Welcome to The Terrible Take, a daily segment telling Steelers Nation what's on our mind. I'm Alex Kazora. It doesn't take an X's and O's junkie to understand the spot the Pittsburgh Steelers are in. A floundering offense that hasn't come close to achieving its offseason goals of a better running game to balance itself and take some of the demand off Big Ben's shoulders. Right now, this unit can't do much of anything right. So what's the strategy to win? The blueprint becomes similar to 2019 after Roethlisberger was lost for the season, leading to a revolving door of Mason Rudolph and Duck Hodges. At that point, it was clear what the rest of the team had to do, make splash plays on their own, because the offense couldn't be counted on doing so. Sure, defenses are always looking to make big plays, but make no mistake, that Steelers defense had a hyper-focus on doing so, going for the ball every single opportunity they could, making big plays and creating short fields to pick up their lifeless offense. The same idea can and should be applied to 2021 and applied for special teams. It's a large reason for their only win of the year against Buffalo. Miles Killebrew's block punt, a huge play in that game and victory. That has to be the focus and goal. Recognizing that until or if this offense figures things out, the defense can't just keep the score down. Holding teams to field goals instead of touchdowns, forcing punts, all the basic stuff defenses have to do. They need to go beyond that with big plays, turnovers, short fields, or heck, putting the ball in the end zone themselves. It's asking a lot, I know, a super high bar for a defense dealing with its own injuries and issues, but that's how it has to be. Be sure to follow us at SteelersDepot.com and check out episodes of The Terrible Take every day at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. And check out The Terrible Podcast with myself and Dave Bryan every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday.